Hello friends, in this video tutorial, we are going to learn, how to read RSS feed data, by using PHP script. In previous video, we have already seen, how to make dynamic RSS feed by using MYSQL data in PHP, so after making of RSS feed. Now we want learn, how RSS feed data has been read in PHP script, there are many website has accept RSS feed for, publish content on their website. Now let's start discussing this topic, so this is our working folder, in which one images folder and two PHP file like index and red, in index file we have make dynamic RSS feed, and RSS feed code we will write under red.php file. In RSS feed, here in item tag, we have store data of post title data in title tag, post URL data in link tag, post publish data in publish date tag, Author details store in creator tag. Post description details has been store under description tag. Any post media like video or image has been store under enclosure tag. And post category details has been store under category tag. This all things, code we have already discussed in last video, now in this video, we will see how to read this RSS feed data, and convert into HTML format. For this we have go to read.php file, and here first we have write, dollar feed URL variable is equal to, base URL of this folder with index.php file, this URL will make dynamic RSS feed, when it is called. Below this we have write, dollar object variable is equal to, new dom object class, here we have make of dom document class, which is used for read entire xml document, with root of document tree. After this we have write, dollar object variable with load method, and under this method we have write, dollar feed URL variable, this method will load XML data from this URL. After getting whole XML data, now we want to get XML data of all item node. For this, here we have write, dollar content variable is equal to, dollar object with get element by tag name method and under this we have write item this method will search all elements with tag name item here it will store all item tag data into this dollar content variable now we have move for convert this data into html format so here we have write for each loop and under condition, we have write dollar content variable as dollar row variable. By using this loop, it will fetch data of dollar content variable. Under this loop, first we want to print post title. So here we have write dollar row variable with get elements by tag name method with tag name title. By using this method it will return content of all title tag. But here we want to get first content title tag. Here we have write item 0. And after this we have write. Node value. This code will return title tag first node value. Below this post title. We want to print publish date. So here we have write echo statement with this HTML code. Under this code, we have write, 
dollar row with get elements by tag name method with publish date tag name with item 0 index with node value this code will display post publish date after this we want to post image for this here we have write dollar row with dollar row variable with get elements by tag name method and under this we have write enclosure tag name because image details has been stored under URL attribute of this tag so here we have write item 0 index with attributes URL with node value this code will fetch image URL path from URL attribute of enclosure tag same way we want to display author name so here we have write dollar row with get element by tag name ns method and under this we have write ns double color one and star this method will search all element with given tag name in specified namespace so it will return content of ns double colon one and for fetch value we have write item zero with node value it will return author name after this we want to display post description so here we have write dollar row with get element by tag name method and under this we have write description tag name after this we have write item 0 index with node value it will return description tag value and lastly we want to display category tag data so here we have write echo statement with this HTML code between this we have write dollar row variable with get elements by tag name method and under this we have write category tag name with item 0 index with node value this code will display category of particular post so here our code is ready for how to read RSS feed in PHP now we have check output in browser friends here in browser we have enter working folder path slash red dot php in which we have write php script for red rss feed so here we can see rss feed data has been converted into html format which we can see on web page so this way we can convert xml data to html format there are many sites like Flipboard and many have accept RSS feed for submit content to their sites, so they have display out website content on their website, from out website, without storing data on their website. So, this is major benefits of XML RSS feed. So here we have seen how to read RSS feed in PHP or how to convert XML to HTML. If you have any query or input regarding this video tutorial, please comment your query or input in comment box, or if you like this video tutorial please share with your friends, or even you can also share on social media also. If you want to get more update regarding our video tutorial, please subscribe our YouTube channel for get more update regarding release of future video. Lastly keep watching our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching this video tutorial.